My waist too small, my face too cute, my game too strong, your man too close, he on my phone, about these bills, put mommy on the phone, he ain't never coming on, look, I'm about to go in, I'ma get inside, he bitch your head like a sewing, I'ma lace the track in the front, make it blend in, pull that shit back so the glue ain't sh Get y'all together here. A little bit of technical difficulties, but we are live. Lions and lionesses, the repeat customers, thank you for stopping by. Hello, thank you for joining the Zoom. We are here to talk about your life for the month of July. I always feel like whenever the second half of the year hits time, okay, it, it, fly, back, it, it fly past you, just a gust of wind is july to december okay i don't know leo you know i don't believe in coincidences some of you guys might feel like time is moving fast time is flying by but it's so crazy that we are now past the half a year mark like we are you know more than half a year and this is crazy check the chart any placement of leo can be up in here sun moon mercury rising venus mars jupiter saturn north node and south no places and anybody who would like to be nosy because i promise you they maybe could be possibly probably in here let's let's just take a look at the grippers i really fuck with them okay they're so cute okay it's giving hawaiian tis the summertime um bookings are open price and contact information is in the description box down below all the info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section make sure that you could if it is possible on your end like the video subscribe to the channel please thank you so leo let's discuss what is happening with you let's look into the crystal ball talk about what we can see i had a few things come out and i was compelled to write things down okay because it was crazy how the messages were coming through so leo I've already pulled a card to see what your overall energy is going to be going into this new month. And we have the Knight of Wands. This is my seeking. This is my pursuing. This is my looking. This is my observing. This is my experimenting card. And it's Knight of Wands. While it is Sagittarius energy, it is a fire sign card, so I'll apply to you. Leo, you are in this space of exploring, trying new things, getting outside your comfort zone. Let me try a little bit. Just put a little bit to the side. Let me try it, okay? Some of you guys are in this energy of wanting to try new things, okay? And then we have the Ten of Cups showing up on the bottom of the deck. Kind of like it's like I said, you're wanting to um, experience certain things. And since the Knight of Wands is out here, it could be, um, it you know you know what it sounds like to me. Like it's more <laughs> things more so for yourself. Is that a little sad fish? Okay, it's like I want to take a journey on exploring my own passions, my own pursuits, my own interests, okay? Even if it comes to you, you know, like a relationship or, um, you know, being a parent or other, you know, departments, other realms of your life. Um, I feel as though some of you guys could be in this space of experiencing new things whenever it comes to having kids, whenever it comes to being in a long-term relationship with someone, whenever it comes to you exploring, like I said, certain creative ideas and interests that you guys have. This is, you know, like, girl, you you rocking a new hair color. You know, you exploring uh, different places to shop, different styles for yourself. Like I said, experimenting with your um, own creative interests um, and ideas during this time, Leo, is this space that you guys could be in, right? Now, a few things that I wanted to point out before we read these cards. Um, the first thing that came out was impulse control. While I was shuffling the page of wands and ten of, uh, the nine of cups came out um, and it shot out. Some of you guys need to be careful about not being able to control yourself, not being able to temper yourself. It could be sexually, it could be physically, it could be spiritually, it could be emotionally. It's kind of like listening to the flesh. Like I said, not having control over your urges. Next thing, some of you guys, that could point to unexpected good news. It's like, you know what it, you know what it sounds like to me? Like you, you get, you, you know, you about to get a bill and you like, I know this show, you, this shit going to be high and then you get it. And it's like, not only is it lower than you thought it was going to be, it's, there's a discount or there's a credit on it. It's like, oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so you guys might experience something like that. Um, the thing, these are things that came to mind. A raise, an unexpected pregnancy, a gift, okay? Um, lastly, don't 
be careful about because with the page of wands and knight of wands showing up in your reading some of you guys might be susceptible to letting outside noise or things outside of you even influences get in the way of kind of like steer you away from what your hq is what your um like this is when you're working too much and you're not taking the time out to take care of your own personal chores, your own personal errands, um, taking time out for yourself because you're letting outside influences run you. Make the money. Don't let the money make you. We're going to pull some cards, okay? Because I feel like I'm rambling at this point. Spirit, guys, what's happening to Leo Zodiac going into the month of July and during the month of July? In the year 2024. We got what we got. What we got? I mentioned that I saw this card, girl. There's no coincidence is around this way. I don't believe in it. Page of Wands. What did I just bring up earlier? What card? Roll with me, baby. You're gonna get there safely. You're in good hands. No all state. Okay. I don't know. Some of you guys, something here could be going on um, about insurance. Nine of Pentacles, Four of Swords, Emperor, Six of Wands, Lovers. I'm sitting on the couch and life is passing me by and I'm sick of that. Leo, some of you guys could be in this get up and go energy going into the month of July or you need to be. Um, we have the Nine of Pentacles. We have the Four of Swords. We have the Emperor and we have the Lovers. Hi, guys. Um, Divine Masculine is out here, but there is a woman in this car. So I always kind of apply this to women, too, who just could feel like they're in the, you know, I got to go get it energy. Uh, with the Six of Wands here, some of you guys, there's certain things that you want to succeed or be victorious in right um that with the four swords some of you guys could be realizing that there's certain choices or decisions that you have been making or are making that are kind of keeping you from being in that it's like with the four this you know what this is this is mr anderson mr anderson okay they're about to call you into the back room girl i don't know what's about to happen back there okay they closed the doors there's no cameras um, some of you guys, I feel as though you're like, you're tired of being in a certain stalemate. You're tired of being in a certain status and you're tired of being on, you know, deactivated. All right, girl, I need to get active. Some of you guys, this could be, you know, like an actual physical thing. Like I've been in the gym lifting and I noticed that I've been getting bigger and I feel like it's not because I'm not incorporating a, um, enough cardio in my workouts. Like, it's like, I'm looking a little, a little, that, that boy thick. Okay. You know, I'm looking, I'm, I'm, I'm. And I know it's the gains and everything, but I was like, why am I not cutting down? But like I said, I don't think I'm working in enough uh, cardio. So, and look, the, the beach is climbing a mountain. It's too hot for that. They've left the oven on. Like, we are slowly boiling. I don't understand it, girl. I just got back from Georgia not too long ago, and it was... I, how are people living out there? Like, you know... <laughs> The more soft you go, it's like, oh my God, people are living in this. This is this is crazy. We we we're in the 90s, 10, 11 o'clock in the morning. That's crazy. Firework, okay? Read bad juju. Okay, but <laughs> with the six of wands, like I said, some of you guys could be deciding to get active regarding certain um ideas and things that you're um wanting to get involved in or are involved in, okay. God, I feel like I've been, I've been talking so much. Spirit guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac? Going into the month of July and during the month of July 2024. The Eight of Wands. I'm telling you, there's a there's a lot of movement going on around your way, Leo. Okay. Nine of Wands, Death card, Fool, and the Page of Cups. Some of you guys need to be careful about being resistant to change. Excuse me. Resistant to letting things go, letting things in, letting things I'm hearing expire. And with the food card, it's like, it's not like it's like dead and gone. It's just like with the food card, this is someone here um, needing to make a certain transition happen. It's like an uh, ending doesn't necessarily have to be a bad thing. You letting go of something doesn't necessarily have to be a bad thing. It's like an uh, ending brings a new beginning for you. Leo, okay, and with the nine of wands and the page of cups, some of you guys, you could feel this way in regards to something. It's like you know it's time for you to like. I'm hearing like transition out of something, but with the nine of wands, maybe you're like, no, 
okay? With nine of wands on the page of cups, maybe you're like, no, because there's a certain fear, there's a certain insecurity, there's a certain worry, there's a certain concern. But with the page of wands and the eight of wands, everything in your body is telling you that it is time for you to, like I said, move on from something, transition from something with the food card. It's time for you to put yourself in a new, a new space, a new era, a new cut, a new color is what I'm hearing. I don't know, some of you guys could be doing, you know, different things with your hair. Um, it's like wanting to do different things with yourself. It's like, uh, what, what's the what's the saying? Out with the old, in with the new. Spirit guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac going into the month of July and during the month of July of 2024? I mean, all your first, your whole first role was practically get up and go. Okay, put it in drive. No, not in reverse, Terry. We have the chariots moving forward, being ambitious, being focused, taking the initiative. To, like I said, uh, eyes front, mister. Five of wands, six of cups, four of wands. Um... Some of you guys might have heard or will hear from some individual or individuals from your past. And with the five of wands, I mean, girl, is you the one that got beef? <laughs> five of wands, Leo, is it is, is you the one that got beef? Or is people, you know, do people have the beef with you? Okay, let's, let's be proper, right? I don't know. With the page of wands, eight of wands, and the cherry card, it's like, nah, girl, I'm, I'm kind of off that. Um, Now... I do see two different lanes here, okay? There's one lane to where there are some Leos here needing to, you know, like, oh, God, you know what I just heard? Get over it. It's like move on from somebody. It'll be best for them and you, for you to just let it go. It's like there's some, there could be some Leos here that still want to be involved in a certain, it looks like a love connection because the six of cups and the four of wands is here. It's like either still wanting to be in a certain relationship or still wanting to be around um, individuals. And I say that because I have, I was about to say characters. I have people out here. We have the King of Pentacles and the King of Cups. But with the Five of Wands, you're finding yourself in this space of dealing with conflict. You're dealing with uh, you're dealing with BS. Okay, like I said, uh, keeping uh, staying close to certain people, right? Um, and some Leos I see could have this uh, issue with wa a water sign, maybe Cancer and Scorpio is out here. A fellow fire sign, Sagittarius and Aries is showing up. We have a little bit of earth showing up here with the king of pentacles. Some Leos have taken the hint. <laughs> you ain't said nothing but a word. Page of wands, eight of wands, and a chariot card. With the, with the nine of wands being your overall energy, Leo, people need to be careful about, you know, not taking you seriously. <laughs> not taking you seriously or showing you that with the... You, it, it's almost like if you give me a reason to leave, I will leave. Ain't no making excuses. I'm out of here. I'm not. I'm here. I'm not staying in no in no places I don't feel welcome or I wasn't invited to. Okay. So people need to be careful about. <laughs> I want to say, and I don't know. This is a Leo thing to say, making you feel not welcome. Thirteen, thirteen synchronicities. Okay. Making you feel not welcome because you will leave a space like that. <laughs> you know what I'm hearing? <laughs> How you gonna treat a bad bitch like this and expect me to stay? That's crazy, bro. <laughs> Spirit guys, let's not. That's so immature and unprofessional. Spirit guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac going into the month of July? And during the month of July of 2024. Happy birthday. Tis about to be the lion season. Tis. We have the sun car showing up. Hello, Leo. Happy early birthday, girl. My dad's birthday is coming up. Okay. Anyway, we have the high priestess. Mystic is in the building. Um... Leo, whenever you receive certain opportunities to, with the chariot card and the eight of wands, like, 
I'm hearing take opportunities as they come. Like, um, don't overthink it. Just do it. You need to maybe get you some Nike. Okay, I don't know. Some of you guys might need to get you some. I'm hearing apparel. So, it could be pants. It could be shirts. It could be shoes. It could be underwear. I don't know. All right. But I feel like some of you guys need to be careful about second guessing yourself. Um... It's like you 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 could be capable of doing a lot, but some of you guys might like to play it safe. It's like I'd rather work in the back of the house. <laughs> I'd rather work in the back of the house. I don't want to deal with all the motherfuckers up front. But it's like, oh my god, girl, but you 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 be perfect for that role, okay? I feel like there's certain things, Leo, that you want to get into, you want to do, um, but you you. I'm hearing you want to play it safe. And it's like 15, 15 synchronicities. It's like, where did playing the safe ever get you? Sometimes you got to get a little dangerous around this motherfucker. Not really. All right. But with the page of wands out here, it's like sometimes you got to, you know, I'm hearing sometimes you got to light the, light the lighter. <laughs> so Sometimes you got to be willing to, I said this earlier, step outside your comfort zone. Spirit, guys, what's happening to Leo Zodiac going into the month of July and during the month of July 2024? And I feel like some of you guys could be receiving so many spiritual signs around you that it's time for you to make that happen. And it's like, ah, 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 ah. You got the, oh, you dipping your toe in oh, no, girl. Ten of Cups with the Queen of Swords. <sighs> oh. Um, well, fire signs, I see that some of you guys, um, I know this isn't true. Uh, it's, it's a water, air, or earth sign individual. It looks to be a feminine energy, and I say that because the queen of swords is here. I see someone turning down a certain proposal. Like, no, I'm not interested. I'm I'm going in another uh, direction. That's crazy. Um, if that's someone, you know, turning down someone's marriage uh, proposal, that is crazy. Um, You know, I see someone here hurt by the fact that they burned their last bridge with you. You know, it's like you're not willing to give somebody here another chance to, I'm here and fuck you over. <laughs> it's like, I'm not giving you another, you will never get the chance to treat me like I'm a piece of shit ever again. You won't, nine of wands. I'm not having that. No, you can't come over. No, we can't speak. No, we can't talk. Be gone, all right? Some of you guys have this energy definitely towards a water sign, definitely towards a fellow fire sign, definitely towards a, uh, an air sign. So far, I have Cancer. I have Pisces. I have Libra, Scorpio, Virgo. I said this earlier in your reading. It's like whenever people mistreat you, they kind of get surprised that you being like, well, won't be fucking with you. What? Like, it, it's literal shock. So here, guys. What's happening to Leo Zodiac going into the month of July and during the month of July? Oh, okay. I'm going to read it, but we're not going to put it down. We have the higher fence and the moon with the five of cups. Oh, girl. <laughs> not any of my business here but i do see some uh either someone is unhappy with a man or a man is unhappy with a certain um situation relationship is coming to mind the high fan is out here it definitely could be a marriage because we had the ten of cups here oh my god really like i said i see someone here not happy with a man in a certain relationship or a certain man not happy with someone in a certain relationship uh with the moon car he probably don't um, yeah, girl. He's not public with this. Okay, with the Sun Card and Ten of Cups, he, you know, girl, they posted up at Disneyland, you know, woo, fifth anniversary type shit. 
someone here is miserable moon card in the five because they're miserable in a certain um relationship they they're ready to move on from it they're receiving all sorts of signs symbols and synchronicities it's not funny and it's time for them to move on but i don't know i'm hearing it's like this person gets cold feet you know they're ready to leave, but then they're not. They're ready to leave, but then they're not. They're ready to leave, but then they're not. Well, spirit guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac going into the month of July and during the month of July of 2024? In Terrasante, Ace of Wands with the Four of Cups. I see someone uh, pregnant, someone finding out about a pregnancy, or this is like a baby reaching like one or two years old. Um, this is also, I see a birthday. I definitely see a birthday out here. Um... I see someone here getting new things. You know I love those. <laughs> like, this is someone here getting, like, a new bag, some new shoes. Uh, I just heard a new computer, a new tablet. Um, oh, it could be a gift. I see a gift card out here. Really random. I don't know, girl. It's kind of like the season of gift giving for you, Leo. Like, thank you. Is it because it's your season? Okay, son. up spirit guys i want to go over my time spirit guys what's happening to the leo zodiac going into the month of july and during the month of july of 2024 no 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 well there's one card behind this Ooh, girl three of swords and the seven of swords now i don't know should i put it down because i saw the three of swords but i pulled two back Oh, girl, Leo, what about you? Six of Wands. I do see, Leo, you need to be careful about trying to ignore something that you know um, with the Seven of Wands, either you need to stay away from, you need to keep your distance from, you need to get out of your life. It's like I'm hearing like, Leo, you need to be careful about not addressing something that you know is harmful to you. Hold on. Let me give you another chance. Don't tell nobody. What's this? Five of Pentacles. What the hell is going on here? Remember how I just said you need to be careful about not addressing something in your life? What did we just see? We saw the three of swords, we saw the seven of swords, and we saw the five of pentacles. So it could be regarding money. It could be regarding a certain emotional situation. It could be regarding things. You know, it's like, I don't know why I'm here. Don't ignore the obvious. Something like that. Spirit guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac going into the month of July and during the month of July of 2024? Ooh. King of pentacles, but it's showing up in reverse. Yikes. The first thing that just came to mind is, Leo, you need to be careful about someone not being a... Uh, the first word that came to mind was family man, but it's like someone here is not reliable. It's like you need to be careful about expecting too much or so much out of someone who is not capable of being or doing what you expect them to be or do. Hey, girls, Divine Feminine Empress is here. Um, and I don't know, this could go for mothers to where, like, you have sons or you have a brother. You have some sort of masculine energy, a boyfriend, husband, whatever. You have some sort of masculine energy around you who I'm, I just heard is not pulling their weight. It's like you gotta you you can't keep I'm hearing rewarding bad behavior. Okay, so divine feminine, that's regarding some sort of masculine um energy around you, okay? Um for the men. <laughs> for the men, some of you guys need to be careful about I'm hearing setting yourself up for failure, 
It's like doing things that you don't really want to do and then coming to a, a space of like resentment, you know, if that makes sense. Like sometimes you don't want to be around certain people. Sometimes you don't want to see certain people. Sometimes you don't want to do certain things, but you might do them or you might be around them for to, you know, keep the peace or make other people happy. But it's building resentment inside of you to be a people pleaser. Regardless, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac going into the month of July and during the month of July 2024? Six of Swords with the Six of Pentacles. Yeah, uh, like I said, Leo, I see a lot of you guys in a certain transition uh, period during this time. Um, a lot of you guys, I feel like, are wearing this new attitude, this new style, this new vibe very well. Um, you're no longer dependent on anything or anyone. You are only relying on your skills, your talents, your capabilities. It's like... I'm in control of the ship. I'm in control of the car, okay? A lot of you guys are not putting your eggs in one basket whenever it comes to you depending on certain things anymore. Um, it's almost like you would rather keep your options open regarding certain opportunities to, than to, I'm hearing, lay it all on the line for one opportunity. You know, it's kind of like you always want to have a certain um side gig or side hustle or something else that you're aspiring to while working on something else last card spirit guys what's happening to the leo zodiac going into the month of july and during the month of july of 2024 seven of cups upright with the three of pentacles oh real quick i feel like some of you guys have like i'm hearing left someone like in the dirt like left them in the dust it's like you you moving way too fast for someone. I feel as though there's someone I'm here still in your atmosphere. <laughs> there's someone here still in your space, probably more emotionally or spiritually rather than physically, um, who I kind of just feel like is just floating around. It's like you don't... I'm telling you, be gone. It's like you spray raid on this motherfucker. Like there's someone here that I feel as though you don't really have any time, uh, interest, effort, or energy towards anymore. Um... It's almost like rejecting someone. No, I'm, I'm good on that. You can keep that. No, thank you. A Sag, a Cancer, a Pisces, an Aquarius, a Scorpio. I'm hearing this could have been someone here that made you an option or made you. I'm hearing a background dancer. Man, you like pushed you to the side and now they wouldn't even be considered to be a, a candidate for you. No one's even looking this person's way. Well, you're not. I can't. I can't. We can't speak for the rest of the people, but for you, who? <laughs> Come again? But again, like I said, some of you guys, I feel like are in this energy of no longer, uh, like I said, putting all your eggs into one basket. It's like I'm not going to be in this energy of putting things on the back burner anymore. If there's something that I'm interested in doing, I have a certain pull towards, I'm going to explore that. Th 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 right then and there. <laughs> right then and there. I'm going to do so. It's like um, a lot of you guys are trying to be a lot more. What, what's the word I'm looking for? Forward. Regarding certain things that you want during this time. And I find it very interesting that the two cards that I brought up at the beginning of the reading. The Page of Wands and the Ten of Cups. Wired up showing up in your reading later on. Leo, this was your July pop-up peak reading. Check the chart because you could have any place where Leo be up in here.